Hello, I'm Stuart Ashen. I'm a YouTube man. Also, I have written a book and I wrote a film once and I was in a film and once I had a sandwich. I would want to go with Sylvester McCoy, I think. Um, as the Doctor, not as an actor, that would be weird. Um, I like the way he would set up weird traps. And uh, Why have all the masterminds always got to be evil? Let's have a nice mastermind. And uh, yeah, be interested to see what went on behind the scenes and the little things that went round in his head to come up with all his strange schemes. Also, he was the Doctor when I was young, so that always resonates a bit, doesn't it? Ooh, see, I'd like to say something like uh, Sarah Jane or Martha Jones, one of the more independent ones who can go off and do their own thing, um, aren't necessarily reliant on the Doctor to do stuff, but I think realistically I'd be more like Adric. I'd just get on the wrong spaceship and get blown up or something. Oh, that's easy. I've only ever actually been scared of one Doctor Who villain ever when I was young, and it's the Raston warrior robot from The Five Doctors, which is... Like one of the least visually impressive is like a man in a spandex suit with a reflective fencing mask who jumps around and goes Rip, a lot, but absolutely terrified me. You see it carve through a load of Cybermen, who are obviously these big bads. It's literally taking their heads off and stuff, and that's ooh, a little bit creepy. But it has this kind of Tyrannosaurus Rex thing where its vision is based on movement, and it gets really close to John Pertwee's face, trying to work out if there's somebody there, and he has to stay entirely still. And that absolutely terrified me when I was young. It would have been one of the Peter Davison ones, and I would have been far too young to understand it. All I can remember is it was on a spaceship, and there was a character who was either some kind of holographic projection or an android or something, and he opened a drawer, pulled out a printed circuit board, and said, this is actually me. You know, as in this is obviously his computer brain thing. And I had no understanding of what that meant at all. And I asked my dad, he sort of tried to explain it, and I still didn't understand it for years. And that confusion has stayed with me. Or oh, I like Blink. Um, I know it's a sort of cliched one, everyone says, oh, it's good. But it is really good. And it's such a tight, focused little horror story. Absolutely love it. I would go back to last Thursday to try and discover where I left my keys. Because losing keys is a nightmare, and I still don't know where they are. Ooh, I do love some Star Wars. I'm a big Star Wars fan. Um, I'm a big fan of the Souls series of video games, uh, Demon Souls, Dark Souls, Dark Souls 2, Bloodborne, and Dark Souls 3 coming soon. Um, they are currently my jam.